Hi everyone. As you can see behind me, I've got some boxes that are built up again. I'm going to tackle a few of them today. Not sure which one I'm going to do first. Feels a little overwhelming at times, but thank goodness for my Smart Sips coffee. Right now I've got the cognac flavored coffee. A little bit of caramel macchiato creamer in here. So good. Of course, I might just uh, sit here and sip my coffee and worry about this later. So anyway, as you can see, I've got... Let me take a sip. I've got a couple of Ipsies behind me. I've got a couple of glossy boxes. I've got a couple of look fantastic boxes. I've got Scentsy. I've got an Ellie outfit. I've got some friend mail. I've got some boxy charm extras. Oh, yeah, so what do I do first? Anyway, stick around. Let's find out. See which ones I open first. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome to my channel. I am always super excited to have you stop in and visit, spend a few minutes of your day to, with me. It means more to me than I can ever let you know. So to my returning subscribers, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. You guys are the most amazing people in the world and yeah, I appreciate you so much. If you are new to my channel, I hope that you consider subscribing with that little red subscribe button. I would love to have you come back and join me from future videos. And from the looks of it, it looks like I just became a totally unboxing channel because I've got a backlog behind me. So, yeah, I've got a lot to do. And, um, yeah, so anyway, I hope that you give this video a thumbs up. I know it's kind of important in the YouTube world to maybe help with your algorithms and push your videos out so other people can see them. But you know what I don't understand? is you know now when you upload a video and it will go through and do copyright things and things like that but yet I'll let I mean today I posted a video and of course I keep getting these notifications that someone's posted and I've had 12 people post on my video this morning with pornography links how does YouTube keep letting that happen you report them and they just keep coming back sometimes it's the same person a couple of times a day I don't understand how YouTube allows that but anyway getting on to this happy happy moment I'm unboxing something so I'm so so excited so the one that I picked out to do first is my Scentsy unboxing and I do have a whip box that's probably my uh, my Scentsy club with my whip box is probably already shipped and I'll probably be seeing that next week and I did get a Scentsy collection in earlier this month or could have even been last month it's been a while but anyway, they had, and I believe it's already sold out, it is called the Life's a Garden Wax Bundle. So, um, yeah, it's like different herb scents and things like that. It was a special with, I think, five bars for $28. And then I added a bundle of like some six um, summertime fragrances, spring and summer, to kind of get my house in the mood because I'm kind of wanting to make it nice smell nice and fresh again i've been using some of my um seasonal warmers um the scents from christmas things which i really love but i'm looking forward to having some new spring and summer scents so scentsy so if you are not familiar with scentsy they oh my gosh it's a, a company based in idaho uh the products are made in the usa um they're sold by a group of independent consultants um, my Sensi guru, guru, my independent consultant, is actually our daughter, Raina. And the thing that I love about um, buying Sensi products that I love is that I know that I'm supporting her small business. And every time that you order from your Sensi consultant, I hope that you feel good knowing that you're supporting your consultant, build her small business, whether it's just uh, some extra cash for them to maybe buy some extra groceries for the month or maybe pay for the cell phone bill or support there. Sensi habit. Yeah, very important, supporting our habits. But anyway, so anyway, let's get into this. So, yeah, I love Scentsy. I just love the different fragrances, and yeah, I'm so excited. Alrighty, so this one was called The Life's a Garden, and they were sold, um, all the bars were sold individually as well, and then, of course, if you bought all five, you got a little discount, because they are usually like $6 a piece, so I got six of them in here for $28, so a little bit of a discount, a little bit of an incentive, Plus, you get this cute little bag. Um, it's got the Life's a Garden right here. 
and then inside I'm sure it's going to tell us, tell us what the uh, fragrances are. So just looking forward to some nice spring summer scents. Alrighty, so, okay. So it looks like the first thing in here is that they gave us a pack of seeds. Right here, so... All right, so yeah, I'm gonna try to plant these and see what happens. I'm not the best at planting things and watching them grow, but you know, yeah, that's a, that's another story. Um, I'm gonna call them tomato plants, and yeah, yeah, they were pretty scary, but yeah, I did that for you know medicinal purposes, not for me. But anyway, so let's get into this. All righty, so this first one is a lavender violet. And, um, okay, so Sensi, they sell all kinds of warmers. And part of the benefit of uh, using these warmers instead of candles is that they're not releasing soot in the air. They're, it's not an open flame. If you knock something over, it's not going to set the couch on fire or your curtains or the rug or papers that you happen to have near your candles. So it's just a safe way. It warms them to just the right temperature. I know that you can buy some cheaper warmer set. I have in the past. Yeah, I'm guilty of that because I wanted to save some money. But the ones that I bought like at Walmart and Target and things, they burn a lot higher. Um, so it burns the waxes instead of just melting them. So when you leave the house and you come back in a couple hours later, it just kind of smelled like burnt wax, burnt crayons. So the Sensi warmers warm things to just the right temperature. So you're always going to have just that soft fragrance uh, kind of filling your home and just, yeah, so it's just, and it's just a, a lot safer. If it does get knocked over, you can just let it dry and pick it up. Um, if it dries on your carpet, get a hair dryer and just kind of melt it and then dab it and pick it up. Um, it's food grade uh, wax, so if um, you've got a puppy that accidentally eats a little bit, eh, it's okay. Um, you know, if your kids go and stick their finger in the wax, they're not going to burn themselves. It's just, it's warm enough, so it's it's going to be a little hot, but no one's ever going to get burned on the wax, and that that's just important if you've got some little ones. But anyway, so they all come, this uh, little wax bar, it's got like eight different cubes in it, and um, let me see if I can pick the whole thing out so you can get an idea so you just have to break that little part right there i call it perforated but that's really not the right word and so um when you've got it in here you're just going to kind of i don't know if you can hear it popping as i could just kind of break it and then you can see it's just kind of scored right there you pop one out you put it in your warmer Marina, Felicity, you know this was coming. There you go. That's for you. That's how you guys know that I'm thinking of you. You just pop that in your warmer. Some of the scents you might want to use two cubes. Some you might just want to use half a cube depending on the strength of it. It's all kind of like a personal preference. How big the room is that you're warming. Um, yeah, it's all kinds of things that go into it. Alrighty, so lavender violet. Oh my gosh, this smells nice. It's uh and sometimes lavender can be a little overwhelming, can be a little strong, but this is very, very soft. Um, so yeah, you got the soft lavender, you got a violet, but it's kind of mixed with like a soft melted marshmallow that kind of gives it a sweet scent at the same time. Yeah, going to love using this one. And the next one in here is called apple parsley. And this one's nice green color. Apple parsley. So this one, I can smell the apple. I don't know what parsley smells like, but I smell apple and pear, and then maybe just kind of something a little musty. So maybe that's the parsley, but that does smell nice. And fresh pineapple mint. This one, oh, this one must smell nice. Pineapple mint. Oh, it's fruity. So I can definitely smell the pineapple. Um, maybe orange and spearmint, I think. Yeah. And I know, um, when I first started dating, um, my husband, Rick, his uh, dad was an avid, avid gardener and he grew mint and just 
when you walked up to the house, if it brushed up against your leg or something, that fresh smell of mint just always smelled really nice. And then later he taught me how to make apple mint jelly. It was really good with this fresh mint. But that's what this is. It's a uh, pineapple, orange, and spearmint. So it's kind of fresh at the same time. And then that fruity fragrance is. This one is chamomile daisy. So this one, it's, it's a very fresh smell again. I can smell lemon. So maybe a lemon, the chamomile, like tea, and some like fresh floral scent. So it must be the daisies that I smell. But um, yeah, you can smell the lemon in here, but it's not like so tart that it's like, oh my God, but just a really soft, fresh lemon scent. And the last one in here is called strawberry basil. So this I can smell strawberry, maybe raspberry, um, kind of like an earthy smell, but that must be the basil. But it is nice, uh, I'm, the fruit is very, very light, but I mean, you can tell it's strawberry and raspberry together. And then it must be the basil that I'm smelling in the background, kind of that kind of, that musty kind of earthy smell. Anyway, I think they should be nice to try. And then, like I said, I got a six pack because if you bundle, you do save a little bit of money. So I got three different ones and two of each. And this one is one of my favorites. This one is a Bonfire Beach. And I, I tend to get this every, every summer. This is like just, oh, it's one of my favorites here. So it's like toasted, like melting marshmallows and sandalwood and like this, the sea here. It just reminds me of going to the Jersey Shore to spend time with my, my brother. So I love this one, Bonfire Beach. Next, and I, I had like an orange creamsicle before that was limited that came in a wick box. So this one was called Tangerine Creamsicle. So I was thinking that it would be more of the same kind of scent, kind of like that creamsicle like you got when you were a kid when the ice cream man came yeah, that's what I was thinking though so it, it is like that but it's um a little bit stronger than that so I think it's tangerine well obviously it says tangerine so it's tangerine instead of the orange so it's that fresh citrusy smell and uh mango and vanilla cream it's very good gonna love doing that this summer just when you come in and you just kind of smell that fragrance it just oh so nice this was a new one to me so I'm not sure what this one's gonna smell like it's called coastal sunset and I'm just always kind of drawn to those kind of coastal scents in the ocean things like that so this one's very very light and sometimes just kind of rubbing it you kind of get the uh, oils going but it's a uh, coconut like a sandalwood again but light and uh, vanilla kind of lessens that, I think, um, like that sweet kind of vanilla smell. And I think I, I might smell patchouli, but I'm not positive. So kind of like a light scent of patchouli, which I love. Uh, sandalwood that I love. A little bit of coconut and vanilla. Yeah. So anyway, that is everything in my Scentsy mini haul. So I am so glad that you joined me and I am one box down. I'm so excited. <sighs> yeah. So anyway, thank you everyone for joining me. Your support again is amazing. I hope you give this video a thumbs up. I would love to hear about some of your favorite Scentsy scents for the summer and spring. And, and we'll chat again soon, everybody. I hope you go out and have a fantastic week. Bye-bye. Hi, everyone. So anyway, just going to quick add on to my Scentsy unboxing my little mini haul so actually this is friend mail from our daughter Raina so yeah so it's kind of it's been here a while too yeah sorry about that Raina and Jeremy and Maddie Matt and Jeff and Jeff but anyway so there I I just opened it and there are some Scentsy products in here so I thought it was perfect to kind of put together so I'm sure she won't mind but anyway so again this was like just before Easter she sent this out but look at this cute little towel with the little Easter bummies Easter bunny bummies. Yeah, so cute. So it's a nice light gray. Just very, very soft. So, so pretty. So cute. 
Love those. And I'll do that in a second. Alrighty, so uh, we got Jumpin' Jelly Bean. So this, it's just like when you open a bag of the Jelly Belly Beans. So you got like that app, the fruity senses, apple and this pear and lemon in here, but very, very sweet, like sugary, sugary sweet. It's like jelly beans. So good. And we've got a scent circle, magnolia linen. And these, I mean, they do have car focus. They do have car uh, warmer scents that you can kind of like you plug into your vent. So um, when your vent is on, whether it's heat or air conditioning, it kind of helps disperse that. But these are perfect to put in your car. Um, if you have a small closet, you can put it in there to kind of do some scents. You can open it a little bit, put it in a drawer. You can put it in a gym locker or, or a school locker or anything like that. It does better in like small things. So maybe a coat closet or something, but not your, your real clothes closet. Oh, this one is so nice. Again, it's magnolia linen. And it's just this little scent circle. I actually put some of these in my towel warmer. So when it's heating up in there and I'm warming up my towels and my PJs, this scent kind of makes it smell nice and fresh when I open it. So it's like sun-dried linen, magnolia, and honeysuckle. Magnolia linen. This is so, so good. So then, because I know I love wine too, I don't know how, but uh, I make wine disappear. What's your superpower? So a little koozie to put around your wine glass so when it's you're sitting outside on the deck or something, it doesn't sweat and you got a nice little gripper. And yeah, I make wine disappear. That's my superpower. Thanks, Raina. And... Wait till you see this, guys. I got more peeps. Cotton candy peeps. I was all out of my peeps, too. So, you know, I love my peeps. Hashtag Nancy loves peeps. So, anyway, that's, uh, yeah. So, thanks, Raina. Thanks, Jeremy and Maddie Matt and Jeff. I'm going to eat these right now. That's another one of my superpowers. I make marshmallow peeps disappear. Anyway, thanks again for watching. We'll talk to you guys soon. Bye-bye.